so as I'm praying for you, I heard the Spirit of God say that we need to pray for your, want to pray for your wife, because I saw an attack that the enemy is trying to bring on her life, an attack, this is an attack of depression, okay? We need to pray against the spirit of depression because I saw the spirit of depression that was trying to weigh down on her shoulders. At times, she feels this depression inside of her heart. God is the giver of life and the same God he takes. Yes, yes. yes. Yeah, it's, uh, my wife is got emotional because her father passed this year. It's true, it's true. But it seems it's... Everything is upside down. Uh, it's opposite. It's, it's not what we want. It's not, it looks not right. You know? mm -hmm, mm -hmm. God says, I must tell you, you must not worry. Let us not cry and feel depressed over what happened. And she is coming out of every stagnation. From today, everything that she does will prosper. Everything she touches her hands with shall prosper she'll never fail amazing <laughs> another level of hope <laughs> because god says i must dedicate this scripture for you you have been cut down but god is saying there is a hope even for you if you have been cut down that you are going to rise again and your tender shoots will never fail Thank you, Jesus. The scripture is Job 14, 7. Okay. Job 14, 7. This is how exactly I felt in my life. Just like everything was cut, 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 you know. So <laughs> it's amazing when you say, you know, what this thing. So. Yes, yes, yes. And this is actually the scripture that God said, I must give you job 14 verse 7 because this scripture is you this is your life and god is going to cause you to rise again and you are never going to fail from today in jesus name thank you jesus thank you jesus amen thank you so, so much for your time <laughs>